I'm here at one of Tel Aviv's most popular movie theaters where there's a lot of excitement about the Oscars. For the fourth time in five years, an Israeli film has been nominated for Hollywood's highest honor. Written and directed by Joseph Cedar, Footnote will compete for the Oscar in the category of Best Foreign Film. It'll be Cedar's second nomination. He won an Oscar nod back in 2008 for his film about the last days of the Lebanon War called Beaufort. This time, Cedar takes us far from the front lines into the world of academia, where a father and son compete for a prestigious award. It's a very human and universal story about the emotional tensions and gaps that can exist from one generation to the next, from father to son, and it's a film that could have been made in any country. Now here in Israel, it won the highest cinematic award at the Cannes Film Festival. It took home the prize for best screenplay. Let's take a listen to what Israelis thought about it. I think it's very exciting that uh, Israel is nominated uh, uh, for the fourth time in five years, especially when it's a film that is not around uh, the occupation and the situation with the Arabs. Um, but but it's it's a like a personal story. It's a very local story that um, that have uh, many uh, international or human uh, aspects. Yuval has seen Footnote not once but twice. Why did you love this movie? Uh, I think it's very uh, un unusual movie. It's uh, it's sad. It's happy. It can make you laugh. It can make you cry. Uh, and it's it's very very good. <laughs> it's I, I think it's 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 the best Israeli movie I've ever seen. I mean, it's like our stamp, you know. And it's in Hollywood, and the whole world can get exposed to Israeli cinema. And for the last about like 10 or 15 years. Israeli cinema, cinema has really developed, you know? What do you think Israel has to offer that may be unique, that, that says something either in the storytelling or, or the themes here? I think in the end films, it's not documentary, but feature films, but it's still um, based on the reality. And the reality in Israel, it's, it's, you know, it's very complicated. And when the reality is so complicated and, very, and so strong, so the subjects and the films are, are, are strong and complicated. I mean, you have so many um, different kinds of religious and different kinds of, um, of the young generation and old generation and the war inside. And, and so it's the, the reality build, build the feature films in the end. Yeah, um, we wish you good luck and um, uh, represent our country well. And uh, we love you and hope you're going to win. But Joseph Cedar's footnote will face some stiff competition at the Oscars. It's up against a film from Iran called A Separation. It's the first time that the two countries, which are political arch enemies, will compete at the Oscars. Now, A Separation just won the Golden Globe Award a couple weeks ago, which often predicts the Oscar winner. What's interesting is that director Joseph Cedar has met the Iranian director and has said that there's something, quote, poetic about the competition. We'll have to wait until February 26th to see which film is announced from the stage of the Kodak Theater in Los Angeles. Jordana Miller, JN1, Tel Aviv.